All right, so this matchup's actually very uh, interesting. Um, Falco definitely has the advantage. Yeah. Well, um, with lasers, <laughs> okay, you can yeah. laser, okay, laser, laser. First off, lasers are great, but Sheik does have ways of dealing with it. The the matchup pretty much goes that because Falco has a good crouch cancel, because Falco has all these conversions out of it, that he can pretty much exploit Sheik because she's got a lot of moves that are just like hit like noodles early on if you do hit that crouch cancel. However, Sheik, but comboing Sheik, as Falco with Sheik is kind of, I don't um, know, if you shine her, she's She's hard relatively heavy. Um, she doesn't fall but, fast though, so if you dare, she's... Yeah, uh, you gotta you gotta kind of gauge that a bit. But yeah. she Which does have like very bad. good ledge opportunities versus Falco. And Falco does have that recovery where all it takes is an F tilt into an, uh, maybe a fair, and you've got that opportunity where you either get the needle gimp or anything else like that. And it... It doesn't it, take a lot. It doesn't take a lot, but it's hard to win neutral at Sheik. So she has to constantly be sitting and waiting for these opportunities versus Falco and exploiting exactly. it. You cannot afford to miss ledge guards, so... Nice no. conversion there by uh, Sheik or uh, Kerrigan. Okay. And, oh, I would have gone for back air there for sure. Well, Falco has so many options when Sheik's coming, like, trying to recover. I mean, he, just back air is dead. Like, Absolutely. Dare is so, you know, there's so much you can do. But here, oh, goes for a questionable read. Yeah. It's like Crispy's kind of falling apart on this one. Do we fix the Artifice Zerk zone? Uh, let's not touch it. Yeah. <laughs> we'll, we'll, we'll keep you guys updated on the set count, but I'm not trying to frick with uh, Ben's stream. I only know OBS, so. Um, it's like Falco gets a nice Nair conversion there. Ooh. Ooh, Ooh sloppy, think, yeah, sloppy. Was, uh... um, tournament nerves definitely probably played a role there. That was not some crispy shit. Converts in. Nice. Gets the pillar going. I think that if he would have shined, he could have gotten that. But uh, oh, yeah. I don't know why he would ever go for that short. You know, I mean, sometimes you nice just got to flex, you know? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so what we're seeing here is, ooh, Falco really taking that combo game and just working Kerrigan with it. Is Crispy part of, is he part of WSU? Yeah, 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 yeah he's yeah. very good. Um, the dude WSU has shield pressure today, like sure. crazy. Um, that was a, a really nice situation there. He go, went for the shine follow up on platform. <laughs> Realized that it was hitting shield and immediately wave dashed out. This looks like it's going to be the sock for sure. Oh, no. Oh. Little chokes. Kerrigan getting part. a little scared when it comes to approaching that, and you cannot afford that versus Falco. Every single time he gets off ledge, you have to bring every little piece out of it, and unfortunately, it doesn't look like we're seeing that today. Goes for a interesting jump. Gets caught out by that into the back air, and the matchup is pretty much even out from here. We might see a conversion uh, on the like next Chris, neutral win. Goes for the back air. Ooh. And gets oh, nice needle, nice needle. Yep. Oh, went for, I think he held L cancel too long and shielded there after the fair. I don't think yeah. that was intentional. Ooh. Oh, and reaches for the air dodge scrubby. and doesn't get it. A little scrubby. Tears. <laughs> for sure. All right, so 1-0 in Crispy's favor. Um, now, I'm not sure exactly where Sheik will probably be looking to counter pick. I'm assuming we're going to want to see shorter stages with more opportunities to get him on the ledge and she, uh, stall, I guess, or look well, for those edge guards conversions. It's so, looking like, I mean, uh, Crispy's run? controlling this. Yeah, I'd go for a more open one. Yeah. Yeah, he needs some space to breathe. But then again, you come here and <laughs> yeah. you're going to feel the full force of that laser. And if Crispy keeps center stage, Ooh. there's a lot less Clean. gimp opportunity. I, I don't necessarily agree with this counter pick. No. I, yeah. Honestly, because uh, Falco gets, like, Need that it's sweet good spot. on Yoshi's, but Sheik can take him off the side so quickly, like convert those ledge guards so yeah. fast yeah, that it's yeah. like, that why not, you know? Yeah. Especially versus a uh, character that... Uh, down smash? That was good. Really good angle. I feel like Kerrigan's still trying to feel it out, but Crispy's just... He knows yep. what he's doing. Crispy, solid, he's has good execution. Exactly. And... That's what you need in tournament sets, you know. That's that's what really pushes the successful players uh, apart from the. Oh, yeah. and, oh nice! I know about those, those needles. The ledge guards are looking. They're looking a little sloppy. Not good. That could have been an easy it, down smash. You're not gonna take this matchup if you're not getting them ledge guards. No, it's that simple, dude. Like, unfortunate. <laughs> oh, nice F tilt, and the, here's the ledge guard situation, and that he a, misses it. But it was a nice up B stall. Great I yeah. did Omps attack a chic jab, and I was pretty proud of that. Nice. Shouts outs to Kiba, uh, <laughs> innovating the Omps attack technology. Oh, and Kerrigan gives up the stock. Definitely could have tried for it, but 
Probably wants to go for momentum more than anything else right <laughs> now. Sorry. You think he meant a mm. That's a little. Honestly, this looks like a lot of nerve play here. I think Kerrigan's. Kerrigan just can't. He doesn't. He's doesn't shaky. He's not. You know, because he's not a bad player by any means. And although Crispy is very good, I think that we could see more coming out of them. Um, yo, this could be it. Nice combo. Nice combo. Misses the tech chase. Again, something you should have labbed out before you go in a tournament, but all good. Ooh, oh, these angles from Crispy are looking. I, mean, I think he's, he's a little good. afraid afraid of Falco on the ledge, and that's a little concerning to me. Um, he's giving Falco back. And there's Crispy with the center stage. All control. right, there you go. I think Kerrigan's oh, having a hard time. Gets the dare. I. I don't quite understand why he's going for those dares. I mean, it's a little reachy. That's what I was going for. And has I would go for every the, the back air converts into ledge guard situation. It's got the possibility of killing off the side if they got some jank GFDI. Oh, reaches, reaches for reaching. it. Yeah, that was a reach <laughs> if I've ever seen one. My god. All right. So we got an even stock lead, but she clearly has the advantage percentage wise here. Um, Falco playing it safe, goes for the ledge guard situation, and doesn't look like he's gonna get it. Oh. And gets the nair. See, she <laughs> up B actually has ridiculous amounts of landing lag, and I don't know why more players just don't hold edge and then punish them there. Oh, yeah. It, it's, it's a pretty simple you scenario. Just, it, it, you gotta you think know? it out. It's always. You know, <laughs> like, yeah, there's, we, there's, we rarely do that against anyone else. Mm -hmm. so Yo, okay, nice pillars. Oh, these, oh. These are good. yo, oh, there it is. Gets that you laser conversion. That back here. And I think it went for a shine grab, but got hit by the uh, down smash there. Oh, nice, oh, nice, and that's there. That's it. Convincing 2-0. So I'm going to start pressing buttons and see what happens. Don't do it, don't do it. Don't do it. Um, I think Ben will get upset. Oh, hey, look, you can, uh, oh, shit. Oh, well. <laughs>